A surprise for a robbery victim in Anne Arundel County. We've been telling you about the woman who bit her way out of an attack in a parking lot of a pizza hut. Said she left her teeth marks on the guy. Tonight, she's showing us what that alleged attacker sent to her. 11 News reporter George Lettuce is live in Brooklyn Park with the story. George. Kate and Stan, Eric Downey turned himself into police here at the Brooklyn Park station. And in the course of talking to detectives, he did something that most alleged criminals don't do at that point. He wrote the victim a letter. That's why I bit him. You bit him? I bit him. Jung Albulheja recalls how she warded off her attacker Sunday afternoon outside of Brooklyn Park Pizza Hut by biting him in the hand. The attacker, Eric Downey, took off, but he ended up stealing her purse and using her credit cards. She knows it could have been much worse. It just was horrible. It was horrible. By Wednesday, Downey turned himself in. He told detectives that during the struggle, he dropped a toy gun in the back seat of her car. Back of my seat, which is, I didn't even know, I've been driving for two more days. When the detective came to her house to get the toy gun, he dropped off this, a short, handwritten apology letter from Downey. It reads in part, this is the guy that take your purse. I'm so sorry, and if I can change time, I will. But God bless you, and I will go get help from my drug problem. I'm so, so, so sorry, ma'am. Right now, the bad memories of Sunday are still too fresh. Abul Haja, who's 58 years old and barely five feet tall, does not have much sympathy. I don't know what kind of uh, what kind of problem he had. He shouldn't have done to the ladies. Huge like this, little lady like this. Maybe they don't care. But I mean, I'm like maybe his mother ages. I don't know. You know. So drug problem or not, you. I don't care what he got. That's his problem. Downey has been charged with robbery, second degree assault, and theft. Jung Abul Haja says she has no plans to write him back. We're live in Brooklyn Park. George Lattice, WBAL TV 11 News.